Jeff IW Cam aimed to strengthen the commitment and capacity of communities in 13 small island developing states of the Caribbean to plan and manage their aquatic resources and ecosystems in sustainable ways. With most inland activity having an impact on the flow and quality of water in rivers, from mountains through watersheds right down to the sea, IWCAM set out to show the importance of sustainable land practices in alleviating the devastating consequences to public health, livelihoods and national economies. From the Bahamas in the north to Trinidad and Tobago in the south, evidence of deteriorating water quality and unsustainable land practices have been taking their toll on local communities and the resources they depend upon. Nine demonstration projects were implemented, providing a wealth of experience and lessons learned in practical approaches to integrated watershed and coastal areas management, and notably, tangible evidence of benefits of the approach. The Fondor watershed in St. Lucia being one. Almost 15% of the people do not use pit latrine, neither flush toilets. And in addition to that, some of the communal um, toilet systems were closed down or not functioning. With funding and technical support, those St. Lucian communities have changed the way they think about and interact with their environments. In Jamaica, through demonstration activities in the Drivers River watershed, many ordinary grassroots people got on board and became educated about the health of their watersheds and changed their practices. Farmers in the demo project in Cienfuegos, Cuba, made sure they shared their knowledge across farms, communities, and generations. But IWCAM was not only about how people and communities could restore the environment, it was also about how it could be used to create income. These are just a small sample of the successes. The residents and communities who participated in or benefited from IWCAM speak volumes about how the project impacted on their lives. Based on the level of um, interest within the communities and the knowledge that we got from the project, this project will always continue. The groundbreaking Jeff IWCAM project recorded positive results. Stakeholder involvement was extensive throughout the project. Much of its success was due to its ability to find a balance between meeting needs and addressing the policy issues.